given day here at the Concourse Village West, you see this trash. A teacher here at the Mott Haven campus reached out to us. She says it's become an obstacle course for kids and parents. So she called us. I just want to show you what it's like to walk from the train station to the school. This is just the start of some of the garbage that I, we see on a normal basis. Victoria Alba is an 11th grade history teacher in the Bronx and said Pix11 this video of what she calls the disgusting and dirty walk she does every day to her Bronx school. There's only two sidewalks. One way you have to cross the street where there's no crosswalk. Alba says a sidewalk and street have become a regular dumping ground for trash. That's an average of the garbage that is blocking the sidewalk again to go to these schools. Also, the bushes are overgrown. There's no room to walk and there are abandoned cars. This car is blocking a ramp that people use. Pix 11 visited Wednesday afternoon. It's dirty. There's like abandoned cars everywhere. Like you have to cross a certain way. I don't know how the, how the kids walk this block. This is no way for a child to come to school. What do you want to tell the city? Get your act together. You don't want to walk through <laughs> I do. I am not walking through there, no. All right. Yeah, this is not easy to walk through. I can't see a stroller getting through here. That's for sure. Summer school starts Tuesday. Alba would like the city to clean up the area and keep it clean for the community. We reached out to several city agencies and the New York City Sanitation Department reached out to us right away and tells us, quote, as a result of 311 complaints received in the last month, we have serviced the area just north of the stretch twice in recent weeks. We're always happy to partner with local residents to ensure safe, clean streets. Thank you for replying. You're the only one I've reached out to politicians, the, and the New York City government, and thank you so much, Monica. We will be back to make sure the job is done. And if you have a story, do what this teacher did. Send us your videos and stories to Monica Morales TV on Facebook, Instagram, or Twitter. We're making it happen in the Bronx. Monica Morales, Pix11 News.